The NFL Combine is next week, and the draft buzz is starting to pick up around the league. More and more mock drafts are dropping, and the king of draft talk, ESPN's Mel Kuyper, held a national conference call with reporters today. As of right now, Mel has the Ravens taking LSU's athletic inside linebacker Patrick Queen with the 28th overall pick. But he thinks there's a chance that both Queen and Oklahoma's Kenneth Murray are gone by the point the Ravens are on the clock, depending on how they tested the combine. If that happens to be the case, then the Ravens could look to address the need at pass rusher. And Penn State's Yitor Gross Matos would be a really interesting player. Now he's a big boy, 6'5", 265 pounds, and he was also highly productive at Penn State, putting up 17 and a half sacks and 34 and a half tackles for loss over the past two seasons. Now, pass rusher is a point of emphasis for the Ravens this offseason, particularly if they were to lose Matthew Judon during free agency. Now, the Ravens might need a rookie pass rusher to come in and make an immediate impact on this defense, and Gross Matos would have a strong chance of getting that done as a late first round pick. Now, the Ravens do have a strong history of drafting and developing mid to late round pass rushers. Just look at Judon or Zadarius Smith, and Kuiper suggested that the Ravens could go that route again this year in the draft. Now, we'll introduce you to some of those later round guys down the line over the course of the next few weeks and also next week when we head out to Indy for the combine. And before I go today, I want to make sure you know that the band tryouts are coming up on April 4th, and you can get more information on that by visiting BaltimoreRavens.com band. That's it for me on Final Drive. Thanks for watching. We'll see all of you again tomorrow.